Greetings everyone, Nate here and we are today and I welcome you to Layers of Fear, the Inheritance DLC. So as you know, I really did like the Layers of Fear game originally because I thought it was too boring, I thought it wasn't scary enough and frankly the main character was an utmost unlikable douchebag. So with that in mind, when I heard the DLC uh, coming out, we're going to play the daughter of the painter and yes, this is not a spoiler, it's pretty much said in the freaking you know, trailer of the game, I thought maybe this will be much better, maybe it'll just be scarier, maybe it'll, you know, shed some light on the character some more, maybe it'll actually give us more interesting scare. So with that in mind, let's get started with this. Uh, I did test the game to see if it, the DLC was running properly, so without further ado, let's go. Yes, I'm gonna start a new game. So let's see what this DLC has to offer us. And I hope it'll be good. But, yeah, as I said, with my, and I, I'm, I'm gonna repeat myself and I apologize, but with the previous layers of fear, as I said, I, was, I never felt really scared, I never thought, I never felt really scared because, you know, the monster could not really kill me or harm me. All it did was just attack me and I would fall down and wake up in a different room or something like that. So, that's kind of my problem with this game. I guess, I, I know it's supposed to be like psychological horror, but even then, it could have been better, so, you know, maybe this DLC will somehow be better. And I do apologize if my voice doesn't sound right. I'm kind of having allergy problems at the moment, so, yeah. My nose is kind of stuffed up, so my apologies for that. As in the future, and, and, and Sarah. When I was a child, I used to lay in bed late at night, staring at the ceiling. Listening to my father scream. Yeah, he would also always scream when he stopped at broken bottles. Scream at yet another failed masterpiece. Finally, just scream out into the darkness. It darkness, I'm calling you out. And even when they took me away, the screams followed. Uh, Everfoss, he is a psychologist girl. In my family. It's time to make it stop. No, seriously, I thought of seeing a psychologist, I mean, that could be helpful. Sickness is insanity and death are were, were the angels that surround my cradle and they have followed me through my life. Edward, Edward Munch. I have to turn on the flashlight. Ooh, so he has a flashlight in this game. Interesting. Well, so we're back to our old house. It seems daddy beloved didn't keep very good sh in very good shape. So let's see, where do we go from here? We have several different rooms. Come on, open. This stupid thing. Open. Okay, what do we have here? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Lots of nothing. So let's see, what doors do we have? Does this open? Yes, it does. It leads to the basement. So we're gonna close it now. And does this open? Yes, it does. Oh, it's the. Oh, you couldn't come here in the morning? No, you had to come here during the night when it's raining. Smart move, girl. Smart move. Ooh, what do we have here? Paint can. Huh. Dried up paint. Okay, nothing special. Ooh, what's this? A note? Nope. Uh, scribbles, scribbles. Yeah, he really went cuckoo. Uh, what's here? Nothing. Here also nothing. Whoa. Trippy flashbacks. Now oh, this takes this time to load. Maybe I should have put the graphics lower. Hmm. I need to do that with the next video. These long times are gonna be longer. Oh, there we go. Oh. Okay, so I guess we're. Mm, I know I was got. Let's try the paintbrush. Whoa. Oh, the summer trees. So yeah. Green, vibrant, and full of life, but also young and spirits. Hey. Let's try to find them a more poignant sense where they are wiser. Man, you're a... Put that down. You're 
doing so well. Okay, okay, Jesus, dude. Okay, calm down. Wow, you are a douchebag, Dad. Seriously, I heard of critics, but come on! Give me a girl a break. The fuck was that? Okay, so I guess we're trying to paint here. Oh, they sway in the breeze, but are none the wiser. Just like you. Seriously, dude, what's your problem? God, still a douchebag. Seriously, dude! I didn't even start this game. You're already an annoying fucking douche as you were in the first game. Fuck you! Okay, what do we get from here? Uh, can we use this? That's for sure. Uh, can we take something here? Nope. Can we take something here? Nope. Uh, hmm. Okay, what do you want me to use, Daddy-o? Wow, I can't believe I used that slang. That was terrible. Oh, red paint. Maybe this will help? Ah! What? Ugh. Ghost dog? Fucking ghost dogs. Okay, what if we add this? Ah, yes. The autumn of life. When man seeks shelter from the elements. <laughs> Let's see how our little hut fares when the skies grow dark. Uh, skies grow dark. Okay, we need something dark. We need a black color. Uh, is this black? No, this is yellow. Okay, we need to find something black. To emphasize the darkness. Darkness consumes you all. A very consumed dish to schnozzle. Is this black? I think this is black. Look black to me. God, what, this is fucking, fucking labyrinth or something? Jesus. Okay, so... Doo -doo -doo, let's paint a lovely little painting. He better like it or I'm gonna smash this stupid painting over his fucking head. I swear to God. Okay, so I need a dark color. Mmm... Okay, I took red. Is this dark? No, put that down. You were doing so well. Okay, I don't need to use this then. What the fuck? Why do, uh, do I have the fucking crayon then? Dick cheese. Okay, maybe yellow will help. I hope it helps. Because if not, I'm seriously gonna smash this paint. I'm trying to find something for the dark skies, you douche. God! Seriously, not even the first part of this game, and he's already an annoying fuck whistle. No wonder your wife and child left you, you fick. You f Ugh! I can't even f think of a good swear word for this guy. Asshole. I'm gonna call him an asshole to the end of the day. Douche. Okay, black collar, black collar. Ah. Okay, with the ghost. Oh, Christ. Hey, get away, get away. Huh? Oh, we are officially tripping balls here. Is this black? Alright, give me that black color. Give me. Give me, give me, give me. I want it. I'm not gonna get out of here until I get that black color. So give me! Do I need to do something here to get it? Uh, can, uh, can I jump? Nope. Can I reach out? Nope. What the fuck do you want me to do, game? I'm not psychic. Can I can't push this. Okay, I'm officially getting lost here. Can I sit? Nope. Can I do anything here? Nope.
Okay, I'm missing something here, something very important. It better be good what I'm missing here because I have not a sign clue how to reach that stupid black color over there. The cat's face change? I think it was a happier face. Do we need to push things here? I cannot push anything. Oh boy. Just the start and I'm already confused with what I need to do. Good. Fucking good. God, there's a lot of toys here. Oh, oh, I need to push this fucking thing. Now I... God, fuck me, I'm stupid. Sorry, toys. Come on, push you stupid thing. Push. By the power of Grayskull, push, damn you. Hey, am I getting smaller or this ball getting bigger? Is it like a kind of modern game? Ah, son of a bitch sack. <laughs> Stupid ball. Okay, so I need to push the ball up the hill. Let's go. God, this is more annoying than those puzzles and... Mom, push. Push, you stupid thing. Come on, push, push, push. Push. I demand you to push. Push faster. Almost there. Almost there. Yeah, almost, almost, almost. You got it, you got it. Yay, it's a boy. Or in this case, the ball. There we go. Black paint. Gimme. Where the hell am I? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, hey, the drugs wore off. Lovely. Okay, so we need to add this to the dark sky. Maybe that'll satisfy this douche nozzle. You better be satisfied, Dad. So help me, I'm gonna kick you in your ghostly ass. You see, in the end, all we take for granted is fragile and temporary. Man passes while nature endures. Speaking of which, I don't think our proud stallion likes the weather. Let's brighten things up a bit. Brighten things up. Okay, that's gonna be yellow, right? Brighten things up, that means yellow. Came with the ghost dog, whatever. Fuck you, ghost poochie. Ghost poochie, hmm. Yeah, you can rem remember that. Ooh. Uh, brighten things up. I wonder if that's supposed to be yellow. Maybe I need to take pink? That's a bright color, right? I think it's the right color. And I cannot reach for the walls. Ah! Oh. Everything's on fire now. Why is everything on fire? Dad! Did you f set the house on fire again? Our insurance doesn't cover that, you know. Just telling you. Can we, oh, we can run, actually. I didn't know that. Eh, my bad. Okay, now we need to get back. Ugh. Well, will you stop tripping for a second? Please. Thank you. Well, so far I'm not gonna say I'm scared, but the freaky imagery is kinda neat. It's kinda nice. Oh! Fuck you, chair. What's this? Ugh. Out of my way, chair. You're not the boss of me. Wait, did I go in the circle? Ugh, man, this is this. Is, these transitions are annoying. Oh, fuck me! I forgot to say. Anyone who... Oh man. I need to put that at the start of the video, then. Ooh, boy. Or at least I'm gonna put it in the descriptions. So, please, 
before you play this video, just read the descriptions, okay? Because I don't want to... Oh, crap. Am I in the right path? Ah, yes, I am. Whoa. My God. Okay, where's the entrance? Where's the entrance? Entrance, entrance. Entrance, where are they? Aha. Fucking found your door. This better be the right color, Dad. Holy shit, waffles. Dude! Dude! Yeah, yeah, it's kind of like, oh god, that that this is kind of like that Silent Hill game, I think. Uh, what was it? Sh uh, Shattered Memories. Yes, yes, yes. This is kind of like that, I think. Uh, what does this say? Uh, dear sir, in my line of work, one becomes used to receiving all kinds of correspondence, obsessive letters from failed offer, friends from offended readers. I guess you could say it comes to with the territory. However, never in my 20 years of running a publishing house have I read anything quite like your recent letters. Why, I always try to keep my composure in light of your con continuous and in increasingly enthusiastic output, I find it exceedingly difficult to reply in a civilized manner. Hence, let me be painfully clear. We at Marshalls and Wars take our pride in our numerous publications especially our client encyclopedias. Our staff of estimated academics work tirelessly to provide our readers with the most up-to-date information and include the latest scientific data. Unfortunately, your findings have nothing to do with real science, and the visual represents you have provided, although impressive from a purely artistic standpoint, and are not proof of anything. Honestly, your continuing attempts at ref redefining the rat and exposing its true vile nature have turned from being sim simply tiresome to deeply disturbing. If this was some misguided attempt at performance on art, then I must say I find it in very poor taste. If, however, you were being serious, I highly advise you to seek professional help. In either case, I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you. Regards, Charles Joseph Marshall of Marshall Wanderers Publishing. Uh, so daddy was a little crazy about the rats, no surprise. <coughs> Sorry. As I was saying, this is kind of like uh, Shattered Memories, I think. It's got me in that way that we... How we uh, behave in this, in this game, how we act in the different scenarios will paint the picture of our how we foreseen have foreseen the girl's uh, father, actually, was he you know, a loving father who wanted her to succeed? Sorry about that. Was he a complete utter uh, douchebag? Was he an alcoholic monster and, and stuff like that? This is, I guess, I'm gonna say it's kind of cool because, as I said, only I think only Shattered Memories used that idea, and another game series called The Suffering. I don't think any other game used this uh, sort of psychological thing. We'll go ahead, another trip. Here we go. Ooh, a piano. What you playing, Dad? I told you never to come down here. Ah. Oh, come on. I want to play the piano with you. That's not nice. Man, there's a lot of boxes here. Uh, can we go through these boxes? No, we cannot go through these boxes. Well, I guess it's back upstairs. Ooh, another letter. Can we read it? Please let me read it. Oh, jeez, there's a lot of junk here. It's here. Uh, dear Mrs. Mr. and Mrs. Kirsten, I once again implore you to give me back my daughter. Give her back, give her back, give her back. Give blah, 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 blah. Yeah, daddy was really having problems. 
Is that music playing somewhere? Okay, so we covered one area, one, two area. Oh, creepy chair. So we covered two areas. I guess there's f f a few more. Okay, let's go here. What's here? Ugh. Hi, doggy. Wow. How the hell did you get out? Oops. Go on, get out of here before I find a way to keep you in there for good. Oh boy. <sighs> Game, you're not helping me be nice to this guy. How's my my flashlight? Uh, I guess we need to take this. 21 kilograms, I see that. 21 grams, wow, why did I say kilograms? So, yeah, daddy was a douche. Was a, whoa, did he break the... Inside the wall? Did he break the dog inside the wall? Dude, not cool! Wait, did he try to set the dog on fire? Dude, double not cool! Who wants to burn a dog here? No, wait, I guess he locked the dog, the dog in the pantry. Yeah, 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 yeah that's how it's gonna be. So he locked the dog in the pantry. Okay, I see. So I guess any time we need to return here, we gotta put these things together. I gotta paint a picture of how, of who or what daddy was, has been, will be, whatever. Actually, what happened to daddy dearest? I mean, he, as as I remember from the la from the end of the first game, he was like stuck in this house by oh, house traps. Another trip. I can hear you in there. I'm coming, you furry little bastards. You're not getting away this time. Huh. Interesting. So yeah, my actions were gonna paint the picture of how he's be gonna be portrayed. I wonder if locking that door was a good ending or a bad ending. Hmm. Well, I don't know. Maybe we'll figure it out eventually. Like I said, so far it's interesting. It's like, I was... Good question, girl. Oh, what the hell? Whoa, this is creepy. And it's locked. I guess this was Dad's private study or some shit. Okay, let's go here. Hmm. Gee, what's my runtime, I wonder? Oh, 23 minutes. Okay, guys, I think we're gonna end it here right now, so I hope you enjoyed this first episode of Layers of Fear, their Inheritance DLC, and we'll continue with more next time. So until then, bye-bye.